previously on The Walking Dead. No! Fuck? Fucking kick! Kick it! Shit! Don't come over here! Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, this is how it ends. Fuck. What the fuck is happening? You fucking piece of shit, Kenny. I thought you changed. Hello once again, and welcome back to The Walking Dead Season 2 Finale. Let's continue where we left off. Kenny has fucked up. Everything's went to shit. People are betraying each other. It's Walking Dead. He's gonna do something fucking stupid. It would be nice to him so far, or as nice as you can be, dear hostage. But I mean, I don't know. Kenny's went too far now. I think we need to kill him. Let me take a look at you, kid. Jesus. He could have killed you. What the fuck is wrong with him? Shit. You're up. Shit. Kenny's out back, trying to get some stupid truck started. Here, you should eat something. You okay? Nope. I can't believe he's gone. I've lost people before, but it just hasn't felt this, this shitty in a while. He cared about you too, Jane. I know he did. God damn it. <sighs> I shouldn't have come back. I knew this would happen. I knew it. <sighs> well, I'm glad you did. I'm gonna find something to clean that up. Thank you. Thank you. I can't take this shit anymore. Ah, oh, shit. Funny hits us, Kenny hits us. Feeling better? Yeah. Hell of a day. But we gotta get moving. If you're feeling up to it, I could use a hand out back with this truck. This house ain't worth a crap, but the vehicles ain't in bad shape. With a little luck, we can get one fixed up. Be out of here by nightfall. Yeah, sure, Kenny. That's the spirit, darling. I'll wait for you out back. I'll watch it. Shit. I think he's not offered to take us away. I was the baby and Kenny, but I'm not doing that. Clem. Be careful. Hmm. That's it. that's what I was about to say. I, yeah, he's, something's he's, he's he's changed, and I didn't want to face it till now. But he, we need to kill him. It's something we need to do something. What did she have to say? I know she was running her mouth. What did she say? Well, we didn't talk about you. Really. Really, Kenny. Shit. <sighs> what happened? It's over. But AJ needs us now. We gotta stick together on this thing, alright? Come on. Let's see if the truck's gonna go. Daddy always had a half dozen wrecks he was fixing up. Guess that comes in handy. Some bitch. But he taught me respect. A girl like Jane could learn a thing or two about that. She's not easy to like. Well, that's putting it mild. Feels like another Lily situation to me. Is that a foreshadowing? Is she gonna come back? Alright, give it a turn. Who's a sec? I love a little fucking drinking, mate. Alright, up. 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 We're so close, Clem. With a little bit of luck, I can get this thing running. 
And then we can get out on the road and really make some distance. Wellington's gotta be out there. Now those rumors can't all be bunk. Oh, let's go. I mean, hell, there's gotta be something out here other than snow and goddamn Euro trash. Sounds good to me. We're gonna make it, Clem. I know it. Shit. Whenever you say that, though, it makes it seem like we're not. We're gonna die. Mexico. We could go to Mexico, I didn't see that. I don't know how you turn it. Fucking, how do you turn a key? Fuck. Oh. Down, down, down. No. Oh. Did you turn it? Yes. God damn it! <sighs> we'll get it working. We gotta get moving if we're gonna keep AJ alive. We're running out of time. I gotta get this thing to start. Gonna try warming up the battery. Go on inside. I don't like leaving him with that girl. Shit. Sure, just let's see what he has to say. Might have something else to say. Need any help? I'm fine. Go check on AJ. Alright, I'm going. I don't want to talk to, I don't want to talk to, uh, Bonnie. Shit, she's gonna say something bad. What do you want? I'm sorry about Luke. Sorry. It must be nice being a pretty little girl. No one ever expects you to do a damn thing. Fuck you. You and I both know you had a chance to save Luke. You and I both know what happened back there. I got nothing more to say to you. You fucking ginger cunt. If I did that, he would have fell in. The weight would have made the thing fucking cave in. You would have died too. That makes sense. If I went over to him, walked on the ice, it would have caved in because of the bloody weight. And then we'd be in the same situation. But oh no, she didn't get that. Oh, Jane's... oh no. I thought Jane left. Mike and Arvo wouldn't shut up, so I moved him in here. God damn it! Seen that look before. Son of a bitch! I've seen it too. A few times. Then you know what's about to happen. I know Kenny's a nice guy, Clem. I bet Carver was a nice guy too. Once. Shit. Probably had a nice job and a nice pretty wife. Then all this happened. And one day he caved some kid's face in and realized he could sleep at night. Kenny isn't Carver. He just made a mistake. All I'm saying is, start thinking about what happens if you're wrong. You two have known each other a long time. Sooner or later, you're gonna have to decide how much that's worth. Fuck. I think it needs food or something. It's it's true. We need. I don't want to do anything about him, right? But we do need to do something. Seems like you've done that before. You want to try? No way. It's gonna puke. Clem, no. Hold it like this. Hey. Hi. <laughs> My name's Jane. I think it's gonna puke. <laughs> Not gonna puke. It puked. It puked. <laughs> Gross.
There's not much left. I was running with some people a long time ago, down near DC. Some guy got trapped in the middle of a crosswalk. Can't remember his name. He used to call me Mary Jane. He was a douchebag. Oh shit, what the hell? Anyway, oh shit. the dick got Is he driving away? I can fucking know he drive away. Dozen walkers. One after another, they went down there trying to save him. Lost four people before we got him out. They had to try, right? Didn't find out till later he was already bit. Turn and rip the neck right out of this old lady. Oh shit. The look on her face was she was just staring up at the sky. Like she was watching a bird. Shit. Look, Clem. Oh fuck. He got it working. Sweet. It works. What I tell you. Nice. So what's the plan? How much food do we have? At least a week. And for the baby? Not much. We need to find a place for the baby. Yeah, someplace warm. I agree. <sighs> we should head back south. What? We're gonna freeze to death. I don't know whose stupid idea it was to march up here in the first place, but it was a bad one. She's right. What if we went back to house? Wait, what? Fuck that. I was thinking more like Texas. Texas? What the fuck? <laughs> it was just an idea. We already talked about this. I'm sorry. We did? We're going to find Wellington. Right, Clem? Wellington? Kenny, it's freezing up here, man. It's only gonna get worse. We came this far. Jane's right, I think. Going back. Jane's right. We should head south. We're going to freeze to death up here. And it's the best thing for the baby. I vote we go back too. Mike? Sure. Whatever. Look, I don't give two shits about what you people think. I got this truck working, so I say where we go. And we're heading fucking north. It's the best chance we got of helping AJ. What about Arbo? Who? Oh, the Rusky? Yeah, he ain't coming with us. You're just gonna leave him here? I don't give a good goddamn where he goes. He just ask him. We should ask him what he wants. There's a concept. He knows the area. He can help us. Oh yeah, some help he's been. He got Luke killed. I ain't gonna say he helped the situation, but maybe if you'd eased up on him before, he wouldn't have run away in the first place. You ever think about that, Kenny? Either way, I'm not going anywhere in the middle of the night. Yeah, me neither. There could be a herd out there. You want that child's blood on your hands, Mike? We're all gonna die out here if you don't calm the fuck down, Kenny. <laughs> Haven't we been through enough for one day? Jesus fucking Christ. Remember the last time we had a working car and sat around on our asses, Clem? I'm going inside. God damn it! You can't just walk away from us. I think he can. I think he's gonna. Better talk some sense in him. <sighs> For his sake. Fuck. <sighs> God damn it. God damn it! That stupid fucking. Get the fuck out of here! It's me! Clem. Sorry, just give me a second. Close the door. Shit. What was that back there? I expected more out of you, Clem. You know, I only want what's best for that child. How could you embarrass me like that? Well, why can't we just leave tomorrow? Look, we got maybe a day's worth of food for that kid left. That's it. Clem, think about Rebecca and Alvin. I mean... What if Lee hadn't gone tearing across half of Georgia looking for you? A lot of folks died to make that happen. A lot of folks died to get us this far. I know. You're right. Someone's got to keep this group together. That kid's depending on us. <sighs> I wish Lee was here. You too. 
What do you think he'd say? Oh, fuck. I think he'd tell me to try to keep the group together. And to keep my hair short. <laughs> we can't just give up on this kid. I mean, what's the point of going on after that? That's what people like Lee knew. And what people like Jane won't ever understand. Look, I know Wellington might be bullshit, but where there's smoke, there's fire. Krista heard about it too, right? Krista might be there. When I first saw you back at that lodge, I thought I was dreaming. And when you sat down next to me and we shared that meal, well, I could tell that you were different now, grown up. I felt pride. A pride I hadn't felt in a long time. But I need you now, Clem. There have to be folks doing better than us. We can't do it alone. It's the only chance that child has. Yeah, but we can't do it alone. We need the others. And that's why I gotta be able to count on you, Clem. We gotta convince him. You and me. Look, oh, fuck. we'll figure everything out in the morning. Oh, fuck. I, I can't, I can't fucking choke. Come on. Let's get some sleep. There's a voice of reason, be ready. and there's a voice of can it. I'm too emotionally attached. It's been there since the fir first episode of the first game. But... I know I shouldn't go with him. But I have to. I have to. Is that Arvo? What the hell's that noise? Oh shit. What the fuck? Oh, is this like a dream sequence where we see Lee? Oh, we're gonna get kidnapped. Something's gonna happen. Oh. They're gonna leave us! Mike! He's gonna leave us! Oh shit! Easy. Easy now. Step back! Clown. Shit. What are you doing? Fuck. I got the rest of it. Oh fuck. Clem. The, they're abandoning us. We're just leaving. No. Now keep it down, alright? What? Slow down. Let's talk about this, Mike. There's nothing to talk about. Listen, we just gotta get away from that guy, Clem. Okay? Who? Kenny? Clem, damn it, just... We don't have time for this. Come on, Mike. Let's just go. No. I didn't... I didn't do anything wrong. I didn't do anything. Right, Clem. He's... I'm going to walk up to you nice and slow. You're gonna give me the gun, okay? Why are you doing Why this? Are you doing this? He didn't give us any choice. I'm sorry, Clem. This is just give me the gun, Clem. Why? I'm not gonna hurt you. Yes, though. Easy. It's fine. Just... No! What the 